Hey everybody, uh, Scott Russell with Elevator Industry Work Preservation Fund. Today, I'm here in Chicago, Local 2, where they've actually installed the first safety pit ladders in the country. When we started this, it was about looking at the fatalities that we had, and we had a lot of fatalities on the pit ladder. This is the beginning of the end of fatalities on the pit ladder. And with me is Shane and John, who did the install. This ladder is a game changer for the future to save lives of elevator mechanics. So there we've run the car up. Now we're gonna check our stop switch. All right, so now that we've got everything safe, we've got our pipe stands up, we're locked out, tagged out. Now we're gonna show, how, did, how would you do an annual test on this? So what we're gonna do is the code says that it has to shut off with 20 pounds of weight on it. So we're gonna put 20 pounds of weight on the rung of the ladder. When we were designing this and trying to get it into code, the 20 pound weight came about because I didn't want somebody leaning their weight or, or balancing on top of the ladder and not putting enough weight on it to trip. So we kind of came up with the 20 pounds as, as that's about how much you're gonna put if you're, if you're balancing on top of that ladder with one foot. So now that we've got our weight hanging, we're gonna go to the machine room and unlock, and then we're gonna come out here and try with our access switch and see if our 20 pounds has the car shut off. And we're gonna do that now. Now. now we're back from the machine room and we've got the, the car back on, so we're going to give it a try with our access switch. Up, down, no movement. So we passed the test. That's an annual test. Now we're going to talk a little bit about maintenance. I'm going to get in the pit here. We're going to look at the ladder a little closer and see the few things that you have to do to maintain this ladder to make sure it's going to work properly. So just, just basic maintenance on this ladder. We've got slides here and we've got slides at the bottom. We want to make sure they're free and clear, everything's sliding good. So we check it out, make sure there's no debris that is settled in here and at the bottom. We're going to look at our switch here and make sure our switch is free and clear. It's still mounted good, everything's tight. Our springs are set, they're fine. We just want to make sure everything is good. We also want to make sure at the bottom of the ladder on the floor that no debris has settled underneath that would prevent us from, from having that ladder move down a little bit. And just as a reminder, I'm in the pit, so I got pipe stands up. Anytime you're working in the pit, we all know we need to have those pipe stands up. And we're also locked out, tagged out. Successful installation, great job guys, thank you very much. We started this three years ago, and this is the first install in the United States. It was a long process, coming up with the prototype, designing how it would work, getting it through code, and now finally to installation. And this is just the beginning. Our goal is for every elevator in the United States and Canada, and you know, basically around the world, to have safety pit ladders in them.